Titan safety Amani Hooker never forgets where he's from. That's why he travels back to Park Center High School in Minneapolis each summer to host a football camp that is about more than just football. It's really about family. Not just the people you're related to, but the family you develop in high school athletics, that family that lasts a lifetime. Amani Hooker let us go back to Park Center High School with him, and the day was filled with special memories, especially the admiration that Amani has for his older brother, Quentin, who was Mr. Basketball in Minnesota in 2013 and still plays professionally overseas. We learned that Amani Hooker will always be a hero at Park Center High School, and we're sharing that day with you tonight in the Epic Western Spotlight. So when you came out here as a freshman, mm -hmm. how nervous were you? Pretty nervous because um, I was playing against guys that were my brother's grade, you know, my brother's friends. And my dad was like, all right, you know, they're, those are big boys. You're playing with some grown men, like they're seniors. But um, my freshman year, I started at corner as a freshman and played the whole year. You know, but you weren't intimidated when you came in as a rookie with us. So yeah. did it come from that experience that you had had, that you had so. some confidence from a... Right, I think it did. Um, I think being, going through what I did here and then going to the pros and playing against older guys, I think I just turned 21. So like, I'm playing against guys that are in their 30s and 20s and <laughs> I'm just a little a kid that left early in college. So I th think it definitely prepared me um, and helped with my mentality. What did the camp mean to you? It meant a lot. I know that's something that if I was a kid and that happened, I would be definitely at that camp and that would be a big deal for me. So I try to give back to the same thing that you know I think I would like when, if I was a kid. Did they ask you a lot of good questions? They asked me a lot of you know the usual questions. How big is Derrick Henry? <laughs> <laughs> hey, is, he, is he really fast like that? And you know just the regular stuff. But yeah, they asked they asked some great questions. Who are these people, by the way? Those right there, I think those are the hookers right there. <laughs> That's, is that your parents? That's my parents right there. All right, there. listen, we got to go over and say hello. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> We've got everybody here. It's like starting all over again. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. What's up, Bash? <laughs> What's up, bro? Give them, give them nuts. Get, nice give them to nuts. see you. How are give you? Give them nuts. How you doing? It's good to see you, Bash. This is Xavier right here. How you doing? What's up, bro? You doing good, man? It was the thing. It was the thing. Yeah. So we found out. you over yeah. here. Oh, yeah. yeah there you Looking go. good. Uh huh. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. it. Love so here. you grew up here. Yeah. My sister's. She's about nine years older than me. So I've been in here since I was six, five years old, running on these mats. No kidding. Yeah, yeah. Oh, what's up? Yeah. How you doing? That's my child. Uh huh. Wow. Bring back any memories? Yeah. I mean, some funny <laughs> memories. Yeah. This is memories right here. This is where my. This is my brother's. He built this. We're not in Minneapolis that often, right. so we get to see the Quentin Hooker sign. All right. It's a legend right there. From what you said, though, that means as much to you as the pictures of you here, right? Yeah, I mean. Because he's your hero. He's the inspiration. Like, he's the one that set the whole tone for, for the whole, the whole, my whole career, honestly. Our, you, our old football locker used to be downstairs, right? Right. This is a new one. It's a new one. Okay. Oh yeah. Yeah. Looking good. It's a smooth. Well, no matter where you go, how much money you make, how fancy the pros are, right. this is still really where nah, you're from. Exactly. Nah. Everybody on the team, this is where you're from yeah. in a locker room like Just this. like this. Yep. And a Friday night. Right, Friday night lights. And all your friends. <laughs> It's yeah, the best. You can't beat it, honestly. Yeah. Uh, you really can't. Because at, at the time, you're just a kid, and you're just having fun. And it's, it's a kid's game. And sometimes you forget about it being a kid's game when you get to this level. And you just got to remember like about where you came from and what you wanted when you were there. No, it feels great. If you got a lot of flashback feeling. Even the smell of the school you know, brings me back to the time when I was here. And honestly, can't beat it. I mean, it's just amazing. Habani explaining as we went through the cafeteria that he could still smell the chicken sandwiches. They love chicken sandwich day. He said it wasn't exactly like a Chick-fil-A chicken sandwich. But, but it was close. It was, the, it was the high point of high school. That's, that's a guy who's rooted in a lot of good stuff, Amani Hooker. It is, and you can see that the family and his parents and his brother and everything, he talked about his sister, you know, and it brought him to that high school. And, you know, he's been, been, been great here for us and, and really have enjoyed 
you know, getting to know him and his family and, and kind of, you know, his journey. And, you know, he's really continued to help us and he has to help us and he's got to lead us and he's got to, you know, he's been, been playing good football and he's got to continue to, to do that. And it was, a, it was a really cool piece to see him go back and, and visit his high school.